ITR Boxing. You heard it here first. Pretty cool videos. And I heard they're also in HD. ITRboxing.com. I mean, he's the he's the spectacle guy now. And if we were not in COVID times, he's you know, we would be in Vegas and we'd see all the celebrities being introduced. Like, you know what I mean? It would be like a real be a real carnival like atmosphere, but like, you know. But like the old Tyson fights, it would be something like that, where it's just like, man, this is the who's who is here to watch the, the figurehead of the sport. So, uh, I, I, like I said, I, I think he really, uh, I don't know if he's going to beat Manny, but it would do, it would do him a world of wonder. And I mean, don't count. I think Tank also is proven himself to be a, 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 a draws. I, that's why I want him to fight Tank because I think Tank's shown he can fill, he can fill some stadiums too. And he's a guy that, uh, is also I want to always watch him fight. So though, and that to me is that's the fight I truly, truly want. I think both guys are are proven to be bigger draws than 99.9% of the boxers that are out there right now. So um, that's the one I want. But again, man, he's fine too. <laughs> this is what I look at when I see um, Ryan versus Tank. It's like urban rap culture versus the disney channel and it's the same age group you know what i mean it's like the rap the, the rap age instagram age. right culture taking on like the disney channel star that's growing up and now he's gonna do kind of young heartthrob movies he's kind of like what was that kid's name um god damn it he was like a heartthrob like, like the a, one like the Corys, like Corey Haim, Corey Feldman. I'm going back. No, to you. I'm thinking it was like the early 2010s. He was like a teenager, and then he did probably did some stuff and got to 210. And he's like takes his shirt off, and he, the girls are like, "Oh shit, he's sexy." Oh, as hell. I know you're talking. I know. I yeah, yeah. He's like an actor. Yeah, yeah he's an actor. So I know like, what you're talking about. So like can't, that's can't Ryan talk. Garcia to me. It's like he's he's going out of the teen phase and now he's going into this i'm a i'm a sex symbol star guy and then you got gervonta oh zach efron you're talking about zach, zach efron. efron so to me ryan garcia reminds me of zach efron if you've and, ever seen the beach bum great movie with matthew mcconaughey zach efron is fantastic in that sorry to interrupt you just had to throw okay i mean I, I i love movies so that would oh. be in my queue uh yeah harmony current is a great director so i, oh, I know his work yeah, go watch the Beach Bum. It's wild, and Zac Efron is fantastic in that. Sorry, but yes, oh, I think you're right though. Gar Ryan Garcia is definitely the Zac Efron of uh, professional boxing. But you know, I'm excited, man. I'm excited to see uh, if the fight actually is happening. What he's doing next? I want to know what Tank's doing next. Like, it, lightweight's an exciting division right now, man. I'm, I, I, I want to see what all these these guys at 135 when they're going to fight each other uh and Devin Haney too I, I, there's a lot of interesting stories to be told so uh and when whatever Lomachenko comes back probably will be till the end of the year but uh I can't wait I can't wait to see how the whole division play, plays out well, what's t Fimo gonna do I mean combosis, just so many... like that's combosis it seems like he's gonna yeah yeah probably combosis chance. Yeah, that's and then, one for top. They like top rank likes making easy easy fights that they can make. Not in terms of not in terms but, of challenge, just easy, just, just easy to, to put make. together. 